Okay, hello dear friends. And uh, it's time to go back to school. I think the pressure is slowly building up. I feel that. Uh, I start to feel the pressure of it. It's just another day of life. I should not be. And I have been working for so long, for so many years in the same position. I should be okay with it. But, uh, well, it happens to everybody when things change, when new things come, new challenge come. I need it uh, makeup will do me good. <clears throat> At least put me into the right mindset. I know there are ladies that uh, they look pretty without makeup and uh, I do not have that courage and uh, I feel very much at my own skin, in my own skin, when I do a tiny bit touch up, grooming or taking care of myself. So whichever way comfortable with you, go for it. And uh, <clears throat> I intentionally make this hair, this style, so that you can see the gray hair in my head. And uh, I used to cover it up, always cover it up, and now, the other day I have uh, talked about uh, our hair going grey, and this is no longer a secret that I have grey hair, I have white hair, I have silver hair, stone hair, salt pepper hair, whichever way you name it. I have I am aging in my own term and um, by telling the truth it gives me up so much courage and uh, comfort. I feel much more comfortable just to be the way. I still do not have the courage to go totally uh, without dyeing, without dyeing the hair, dyeing the hair, dyeing the hair, but uh, dyeing the hair, it's not French. And, uh, but uh, just by telling you the truth and uh, no need to be afraid, no need to cover up and be ashamed of having it, it is such a relief. You can see obvious the, the aging here. It's okay. I think I should be okay just to one day when I am totally ready not diet at all. I am not yet totally comfortable and uh, maybe tomorrow or tonight I will diet. And it's very comfortable for people to dye the hair, the hair at home now we have all the different choice, different brand. Different brand and uh, it's not uh, expensive at all. For my hair, one uh, color costs around $10, $8, $10 something like it and I can use it for two times, two times is a month, so each month I get myself ready for about ten dollar to dye my hair. I think it's something I can afford. <clears throat> and. Uh,
And uh, <clears throat> recently, just yesterday, I posted uh, uh, on Facebook. I saw I, on Facebook. I I posted something about drinking wine. Oh, something. I saw one beautiful lady. She she was struggling with uh, um, with alcoholism, and uh, then I posted. I just do not understand why people like alcohol because I do not like it and uh, I just cannot distinguish it a good wine, a uh, not so good wine and uh, when we eat dinner or when we go out the restaurant give wine and I taste them and the good wine is good, I can understand a little bit, but I really cannot get that much passion and uh, there's a story behind it. I will not talk about that story. I used to 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 be not so against wine, although I never know that much, but uh, there was a wine business and uh, I almost got involved in uh, selling wine and then there was one incident, one friend very not, not that um, friendly, what do I say? It's not good to say bad things about other people, but anyway it was not a pleasant experience. So I do not drink wine now, I cannot distinguish wine. And then I post this wine that I do not understand. Then there are people um, <clears throat> chatting and, uh, and talked much deeper about, uh, about this wine, see? And alcoholism, it's like depression, it's a disease from what I have learned from other people to tell me. And um, we, we should not say rude things to other people if we do not understand it. We should not say ignorant things to other people, to hurt other people. Maybe because we do not understand it. And uh, from what I have learned, it's a disease. For some people to say it's a disease, it's like depression, it's a disease. And uh, what I think, we should not discriminate those people because they have alcoholism. Same as we should not discriminate other people who has other disease. Same as I would not like you to discriminate me because I have frozen shoulder. It's a disease. We as a person who suffer, we are the victim of those disease. We hate those disease. And from time to time, we got hurt by those diseases. We want to get rid of it, we want to fight it. And ourselves do not have that ability to do that. That's why we, that's why we go to doctor, doctor, doctor give us injection, doctor give us operation, doctor give us uh, physical therapy, give us different way of treating it. And, uh, but we should not we should not discriminate other people. We are the victims of different kind of disease. We need help. You need help. At one day, at one point for one certain disease, you need help. 
at one day, one certain point, one stage of your life, you need help. Same as I need help. And uh, the way we can do, we should do, is to help in each other. It's like same as food, as other things. Maybe we are lucky in our gene. We do not understand alcohol. We cannot distinguish alcohol. We cannot distinguish the taste and things. But let me finish so that I look better. I'm sorry. Where were we? Oh yes, we were talking about uh, understanding people and, and different people have different problems. So maybe this person, those people, they were unlucky, they were stuck, and they were knocked down by alcoholism. We were just lucky in our gene, we do not have those uh, appreciation or interest in alcohol. But maybe we were stuck, attacked by other addiction. Tea, too much tea is equally harmful for us. And too much coffee is equally harmful for us. And too much food, too much sweet, too much salty food, too much of anything is the same. We do not have that addiction. We do not have drug addiction. We may have other addiction. And uh, <coughs> We have our own problem. Each person has a certain problem. And uh, people get addicted to things. It's, there are always the dilemma of things. There are always the two sides of things. If a person does not get addicted to anything, this person may live a life without passion. Only when you live with a passion, with so much love, so much interest, you get addicted to it. You get addicted to painting, you get to addicted to fitness so that you exercise every day until you die, and you paint too much until your house is totally a mess, and uh, you get addicted to, to food until you eat to become so fat and you get addicted to, to losing weight until you become a, a thin as a stick and you get addicted to alcoholism or you get addicted to anything. It is because our passion, it is because our interest, because our, our deep, deep love and interest and if a person does not have this deep, deep love and interest and just play, the life will be boring. It's not, not fun. And uh, the point is to get a balance. I am saying it not because I'm doing good, it's because I'm also suffering from time to time different kind of uh, too much interest. And uh, I am learning, we are all learning to control ourselves, to diversify our interest. And something is more harmful to us, something is less harmful. And uh, to get addicted to painting, you just have too much painting at the end. 
you can burn it, you can recycle it. At the end, you can, you can, you can get rid of it. And if you are famous, maybe because each each piece become one million, you become rich out of it. Anyway, and uh, <clears throat> if you addict to to makeup, you become a very pretty person. Something more harmful, something less harmful, and we need to diversify our interest and uh, walk away from our existing world, looking for new things, searching for new ideas, for searching for new inspirations. Stay at home the whole day is a very bad addiction. Don't do that. Make sure you stay at home sometime then you go out. Even if you do not shop anything, go to shops. Shops, there are many, many beautiful things. You can see them, you can get a, a pleasant idea, window shopping, and, uh, and just get an idea, and seeing pretty things make you have a better, better and happy spirit. Maybe at the end you will spend $2 to buy a lipstick, or you buy a um, a bottle of water, something. <clears throat> Diversify your interest. Try to understand other. By understanding other people's problem, we understand ourselves better. We understand ourselves more. By understanding ourselves, we understand other people more. Gray hair. So what? This is me. There will be a day we are ready for who we are. Go for it. There will be a day we are ready to be another person than who we are. Go for it. Do the right thing. Do the things. Make a decision before talking to yourself, talking to your heart talking to your sense of goodness. When you can settle with yourself, with the good side of yourself, with the true side of yourself, you are okay. Every person has an angel and a devil in this person. Do not let the devil overcome, cover up the angel. Let the angel conquer, calm down the devil, the evil. Bye bye friends. You have a beautiful day. I am ready to go back to work. No matter ready or not, it is time you go for it. <laughs>